The fight against the emerald ash borer continues as ash trees at St. Michael Cemetery in Sioux Falls received their second round of treatments. As Kelly Sean Bauer shows you, a pair of companies are helping in that fight by donating time and resources. To help St. Michael Cemetery combat emerald ash borer, First Dakota Horticulture and ArborJet are covering part of the cost. We've donated some, some time uh, into treatment. Um, ArborJet has donated some, some chemical, and so together we're going to treat more of the trees than the cemetery would have had uh, we not donated a time and material. About 50 ash trees inside the cemetery will be treated. What these guys are doing today is they're injecting a very small amount of product into the, the base of the tree and we're entering the vascular tissue of the tree and we're letting the tree's vascular tissue carry that product throughout the canopy of the tree to help protect them from emerald ash borer. Goffner says it's important to be proactive. The problem with you know 150 ash trees on this property, if you don't do anything and just wait, um, once they really start declining, the cost of removal really gets really expensive. Though some trees are being removed to make room for new ones, saving as many fully grown trees is still the goal. You figure some of these trees are 20, 30 years old, and to take those down and put a new one in, my kids will be out of college by the time the tree is back to that size. In Sioux Falls, Sean Bauer, Kelly News.